I started a new Clash Royale account to see how much progress I could make on it, but you can donate to change my deck at any time. So I started my account with the training camp tutorial deck you get at the start, and I decided that it cost $25 to change my card with it all going towards the Cancer Council charity. And of course, the first donation and the first card that was removed from my deck was Giant. Well, I'm going to put in Spear Goblins because I can get them high level. That is slightly painful. It had to be Giant, of course, which made things a lot more time consuming for winning those battles in the early arenas, but it was okay because I still had Mini Pekka, which is great at rushing trash players and taking their towers. So after two hours of pushing, I decided that to make it even harder, the chat wouldn't just decide which card gets removed from my deck, but also which card replaces it. And once chat removes a card, I can never use it again. And so chat decided to donate to get rid of my mini Pekka, which was my only way of winning, and replace it with one elixir skeletons. Falco147, you have to remove mini Pekka. No. They're level one. Ooh, yucky, yucky. So because chat removed giant and mini Pekka from my deck, I decided to remove archers from my deck and swap it for battle ramps so that I could at least have a win condition. But everyone ran tombstone in this trophy range, and so a lot of the games would go several minutes into overtime, and I'd still barely win due to clutch interactions like this one. Genius IQ play on the left. Oh, oh, oh the bypass. Oh my god. Go. Thousand IQ. Let's fucking go, baby. Let's fucking go. And then finally, after nearly three hours of pushing, I reached Spell Valley. Oh! Spell Valley reached. Thousand trophies. Just when I was finally starting to make some new progress, everything stopped dead in its tracks when someone donated the next 25 without telling me what they wanted removed from the deck. So I decided to do a poll to let chat vote which cards would be removed and which cards would be added. Fuck sakes. Uh, yeah, that's a wrap. All right, whatever. Fucking Goblin Hut for Valkyrie, dude. That is such a fucking L. So this was the deck I was playing at the moment. My card levels, as you can see, aren't great. So I decided I would absolutely need to buy the pass for this challenge because with chat removing my high level cards for cards I haven't even upgraded yet, I'm definitely gonna need all the wild cards I can get from the pass. Got it. I know you guys aren't gonna let me remove Goblin Hut from my deck, so I'll just have the most broken Goblin Hut in the game. Cool. This is actually really useful. Oh, level seven as well. That is gonna be clutch. Come on, give me something juicy in this chest. 58 minions. Now, I know it says I'm level 7 here, but this is my first time pushing a new account since the update, so I didn't realize that there's like 50 fucking levels now. So level 7 actually only means my king tower is level 5 still. And I only realized this when I hit level 10. Level 10? What? It's level 10 considering it goes to level 50. So does that mean level 10 is lower? So I'm actually... Oh, I'm level six. What the fuck? Four hours into the stream, I think chat was kind of getting bored of watching me win with Battle Ram, and they made that abundantly obvious. Goblin Hut's growing on me, man. Oh, Sandy. Oh, God. E Spirit. Okay, of course, because it's level fucking one. Electro Spirit replaced Giant there because initially the donator asked for Giant to replace Battle Ram, but because Giant was already removed, they had to pick something else, which meant that this was now my deck. You know your deck's bad when you're calling Goblin Hut your only win condition. Thank God my opponents were useless at this point because this is what my best attacks would look like with my. My new deck. Quick spam. Valk. Oh my god. Go. I pushed for another hour until at just below 1600 trophies I finally unlocked a win condition I could replace the cards that chat hadn't touched in my deck with. Hog Rider! Level six. You know what? I'm gonna play that. Cool. Me getting ideas for the next dono. Fuck. After reaching Pekka's Playhouse, chat still let me keep Hog in my deck, so I started pushing my luck a bit when I unlocked Witch, Goblin Barrel, and realized I had Baby Dragon, which wasn't even in my deck yet. Oh, Witch. And Baby Dragon. What am I doing? All right. Witch. A musky. Oh, baby. Now that is what we like. Level 13. Coolio. But I could tell chat wasn't gonna like that, so I started pleading with them. Guys, I'm not even at 2k yet. Relax with the donations. I am literally pushed like 600 trophies in this whole stream in like two hours. Normally I get like a thousand trophies every two hours. And what do you know, literally a minute later, the next donation came in replacing Hog Rider. Oh my, I mean, yay, charity donation from Sandy for bats. Okay. So it's just the lowest fucking card. Okay. Considering we have bats, which basically makes our minions useless, I am going to lock in Goblin Barrel as the new win condition. But that didn't stop me. And soon enough, I hit the halfway point of 2,000 trophies. That's 2,000. Let's go. I was playing Witch and Goblin Barrel on my deck for the last few hundred trophies, and I think the realization that I was halfway there sunk in for chat when I reached Royal Arena, because 150 trophies later, another new donation rolled in. Oh no, there it is. Fire Spirit. Why is it always the level ones? You fucking prick. All right, well, level one Fire Spirit for Witch, level eight. Uh, why is it just getting cheaper and cheaper? Yep, that's the new deck. Just cycle spam. And this strategy did not work at all. 
I hate this. He's got Zap as well. This is like the same deck and overleveled as well. My cards were too underleveled and my current deck was awful and I ended up losing three matches in a row. Something had to change. So I ended up changing out one of the two cards that chat hadn't changed yet by swapping out arrows for this. Honestly, Baby Dragon might be good. I think I'm going to try that. And this was exactly the change I needed as I finally broke out of my losing rut and an hour later reached Frozen Peak. Frozen Peak as well. We finally got out of the slums, bro. God, that was a grind. It was so relieving because once you reach a new arena, you can't drop below it. So it really felt like a safety net had been reached. But the chat didn't like that. And eight hours in, the next donation came through to get rid of Baby Dragon for an absolutely outrageous card. Oh, what? Sandy donated $15? Three musk? Are you kidding me? Oh my God. God. Wow, well, first game with 3M. Just don't play 3M is the trick. Three Musketeers are especially useless when underleveled because it's so much elixir to spend and they die so easily. So you can't rely on them to defend and they suck for attacking. But I was still starting to get cocky. This is the new strat. 3M are like a last resort. Otherwise, it's just hot spam. You literally can't stop me. I have an answer for everything. But my chat didn't clap back right away. So I took this as an opportunity to keep my head down and grind as many trophies as I could with this deck before chat could make any changes. Nine and a half hours in, I had an insanely intense game that was by far the closest one I had yet, and I was using three musketeers like there was no tomorrow. No, 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 no! They got a splash. Fuck. Now we can just zap Valkyrie. What if I do this? What if? Go. He doesn't realize his left tower is actually the one being chipped down. Go, 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 go. Musky, get a shot. That's fucking crucial. Spear goblins, go. Yeah, he did, he's not focusing on it. Shit, he's gonna go goblin barrel. Oh yes, let's go. That is a dub. Oh my God. And to make that win even sweeter, I even completed my Electro Spirit card mastery, which has an insane reward I didn't expect that helped me so much. Oh, let's go. What do I get for that? Oh, please give me. <laughs> let's go. That is what I needed. Oh my God, that is clutch. That is very rewarding for my dub. Give me something good in this chest as well. Pekka, Giant Skelly, can't play that. Ooh. And to make things even better, this was the very next win. I reached Jungle Arena. And that is Jungle Arena! Honestly, it was all really coming up Millhouse at this section of the stream because a few minutes later, I managed to unlock another really useful mastery. Oh, please, please give me Goblin Huts. <laughs> Let's go, that is so clean. Chat had may have accidentally created me a really decent Three Musketeers fireball bait cycle deck between the 3M and the Goblin Hut, and I loved it. But everything came to a sudden halt when Sandy, the same person who donated for me to put Goblin Hut in my deck, now wanted me to remove it because I finally got it to a good level. No, 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 no. What card do you want in for Hut? Oh my god. I get a choice. I think I need defensive. That's why Goblin Hut was perfect, because it was offensive and defensive and a building. It was literally the perfect card. All right, screw it. Tombstone it is. So I changed out Knight for Prince, which was the last card that chat hadn't changed yet, because with Tombstone instead of Goblin Hut, the attacking was a lot weaker and I needed something stronger. But Prince ended up sucking dick, and I thought I was kind of fucked by picking Tombstone until this genius change was made. Deck seriously needs a spell? I think it needs the splash that the Dark Prince has. And that was the perfect change. I wasn't exactly dumb dominating with this, but that one final change made the deck actually winnable. And 11 hours in, I was getting rocket cycled by this dude on the path to 3000 trophies and clutched up with a sneaky Dark Prince 3M play. There's no way he's getting away with this right now. He missed? Come on, Dark Prince! A fucking go! What a steal! Shortly after, I was one game away from 3,000 trophies, which meant I unlocked a giant chest from Trophy Road, and I got so lucky in this. Please, giant chest, pull through. Give daddy what he needs. 2,000 gold? Okay, that's nothing. Let's go! Oh my god. Then, after reaching 3,000 trophies, it was grind time. Time for the final 1,000 trophies, and I was just hoping that no donations would come in that would affect my deck, because I was having enough trouble game to game, such as in this one.
Oh, left side. Holy fucking smokes. Oh my god, bro. Go. Oh my god, please. Go! Oh my god! I kept pushing for another hour without any new donations, and I finally reached Electro Valley. Electro Valley, eight legendaries to be unlocked. And if I claim this, I get one at random. That's just so disappointing. Now, this last 500 trophies or so was such an intense grind. I was playing three musk against Valk and Fireball every single game and sweating my dick off in matches barely winning like this one. He needs one more Fireball and then it's over. Go. Oh my god, let's do enough! Please! Yes! Let's go! But then, 12 and a half in, someone else decided to donate, but they let me decide which card goes in. But that isn't really helpful at all, because it just bans whichever card I choose in my deck, which has to be Tombstone, otherwise my deck dies. And I only had one real substitute for it, and I didn't realize at the time, but this was gonna make my deck reach its peak form. Well, you've forced me to swap something now, and I don't really fucking wanna swap anything. That could be cheeky. Hunter for Tombstone. We're going no buildings, no spells, balls to the wall. I actually love this deck and I played it for about a solid 20 minutes until I realized the deck had an even higher peak from when Sandy donated again, allowing me to transcend time and space. Oh my God, I've been evil enough, you choose? Oh my God, Sandy, no. Oh wait, I think the time might have arrived. This deck is just an... I don't even know anymore. Sparky 3M. This was the god deck. This was the deck to rule all decks. A masterpiece. I mean, just look at her go in her debut in the arena. Okay, Sparky is doing good work, but like... Oh, okay. What's this? A counter push? Counter push of dreams? Oh! Sparky? What a fucking beast. And then again in the very next game. I'm sorry, my friend, but I'm gonna have to make you pay. This is no longer 3M. It's now Sparky Cycle. <laughs> Another 1 HP Sparky. Oh my god. And just when you thought things couldn't get any better. Alright, we've earned ourselves another devious legendary choice. Please make it a Mega Knight. That would be the, the, the icing on the cake for this deck. Sparky. Oh! That's another Sparky. Sparky's going up a level. Let's go, champ. And immediately after upgrading, the Sparky was already paying dividends in a game I thought all hope was lost. Ooh. 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 Wait. No. Come on, Sparky! Yes! Oh my god, it won me the game. Everything seemed to be going to plan until a new bump in the road I hadn't discovered in my beating Clash Royale series yet appeared because of the newest update. What? I need to be level 21 to fucking get in this arena? No. Who knew it would come down to this? The book. <gasps> level 21! Now you'll let me play. <laughs> And that truly was the last obstacle because under 200 trophies away, I think the chat knew I was bound to make it now if I used everything at my disposal, even if they did me dirty. And after obliterating my final opponent, I finally reached a well-deserved 4,000 trophies. And we claim the emote and we claim 4,000 trophies. GG! What's up my doggy dogs? Every Wednesday right now, I am streaming live on Twitch at around 4 a.m. EST if that's your time zone. So make sure to follow my Twitch. I'll have it linked everywhere. And if you want to watch any of the new content live, come over. Uh, I'll be there so I can say hi to you live. Do it. I love 3M is just the easiest way to counter all the bullshit in this arena. Oh, you're going to play witch with witch witch. You're going to play witch 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 with barbs.